Welcome to the channel, Quantum Ascension. For those of y'all who returning, y'all know how I get down. Go ahead, hit that like button. For those of you all visiting for the first time, please consider subscribing, hitting the post notifications. Because what we do is we give raw, I'm not even gonna say raw, just real perspective on certain things that have to do with your ascension to your highest calling. And the topic lately has been health, uh, food. Um, and I wanna continue to go further. Today I saw a video that kinda alarmed me and I knew about this and I always knew about this, but I never really got into depth until something happened to me the other day. And, it just, and I decided to go further and dig further. Um, as y'all know, I'm changing out certain things to eat, doing certain things today. Uh, I had a Mediterranean style, uh, lunch and that's just, you know, Mediterranean foods. Um, just focused on getting away from things that don't, don't serve uh, the body well. And, uh, today I want to show you guys something. And I won't show the name brand, but the other day I was like, okay, muffins are good. Muffins are good. And I've eaten these muffins a couple of times. I'm like, okay, muffins are good, right? I'm going to cover the name. And I'm going to show y'all where it says, I don't know if I can do this, but every company now has to put this on here where it says, you see the little black writing? You see the little black writing right there? The little black writing right there? It says, and if, and if you did see the name, it's public record. Because it's out there. And it ain't hard to find muffins in a wrap. But I was looking for the, I was looking for the expiration date. Because I seen it, I was like, oh, I wonder how this is. So I started looking for the expiration date. So, you know, when you look for the expiration date, you automatically start looking for black writing. <laughs> so I picked up the, 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 the package and as I read, I was like, okay, the date, the date, the date. And I was like, okay, no date, no date. Then I heard there's a code in the date or something like that. But then right below it says, contains a bioengineered food ingredient. And as I read that, I was like, wait a minute. I came here looking for a date. <laughs> and what I got was, what I found was a date with actuality, like real life food and what's going on and what's taking place. There's supposed to be food shortages. There's supposed to be certain things going on that they're claiming, proclaiming widespread pandemonium, food shortages, go save water, chicken little type situation yes stay prepared always have a preparedness plan but guys this food thing is nothing new under the sun in the days when jesus was fasting they fasted for a reason it's a reason why they fasted maybe in times like these maybe these times here the, the, those times where pandemonium, where the wars and it just seems like everything seems so like it's a movie, like you can't believe it. Like, oh man, it's right out of a movie. What if these are the times are we are supposed to, we, these are the times, I'm not gonna say what if, I'm gonna go ahead and tell you. These are the times to go in and come in within and start paying attention to everything, reviewing what you put in your body and even, and even studying knowing like really studying what you're putting in your body because it's your choice they put it out there it's your choice but if you go they will tell you what they put in uh flesh they will tell you what they put in the sugar they will tell you what's in the muffin if you just read and do your research i'm trying to tell you uh also was watching brother rich shout out black magic magic 363 he had dr b serious on there and he was talking about parasites and how they can take over i've seen years ago where the wasps could sting the grasshopper and turn the grasshopper into a drone to carry the eggs 
for the grasshopper and then when the grasshopper if this was used then the grasshopper dies and then or the eggs hatch inside the grasshopper and the and the and the larvae come out the grasshopper and eat the grasshopper. Basically what they're saying is parasitic invasion. And I want to give you three movies that I watched when I was young. One scared the, sh the crap out of me, Night of the Creeps. It was these little black worms. Night of the Creeps, remember that one. Um, the movie with um, Tom Cruise in it, the, 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 one, the, the, the latest one about the aliens and then the aliens couldn't survive past the, uh, couldn't survive past just natural uh, sicknesses in the environment like viruses, they couldn't, you know, make it past that. And then it was another movie and I can't think about it, but all these, I had, I should have wrote them down. I had them all in my mind, but all three of these movies were hinting at parasites or parasitic infections and there were, t or takeovers of the body in certain areas of the body. And I, rem I remember looking at my stomach and basically these things are alien, like coming from the sky. Like it's so many parasites and stuff up in the sky, it's crazy. But I remember one day looking at my stomach and looking at my stomach and I, and, and I saw my, you know, my, my, my pecs and I saw the nips, my nipples. And then I saw the hole, which was my uh, <laughs> belly button. And I said, man, I look like a face. I said, honestly, it looked like an alien. You know what I'm saying? Mosquitoes starting to bite. I thought I had these centinellas candles going right. I guess I need to get them downwind because the wind blowing this way. I said, man, <laughs> it looked like an alien, it looked like a big alien. And I said, I got to get this thing up off me. Like I played around with that. And then when I watched that video, Dr. B Serious, he was talking about parasites taking over and droning people. Got them off. They're being taken over, overridden. Their brain has been overridden. And remember the other day I was telling you guys, is something out there that's taking us over? I can't tell you what video it was, but it was like uh, you're being you're being like you've been hijacked, you know. And maybe I need to. Maybe that's the one I took down. Maybe that's the one I took down, and I put the last part up. But pirates, something that's hijacking you, parasites. It's a lot that they're not gonna tell you about non-communicable diseases that only can survive in certain areas. And a lot of them are domesticated animals. For one, the cat. There's another one called Campylobacter pylori virus, one-eyed monster, alien. I know that these things are not of this earth. So when you doing certain things and find yourself you know, acting a certain way, epigenetics, eating too much meat, eating too much chicken, eating too much beef, turning into these animals. Please understand that you are what you eat. I wrote a book about this. It's called Trojan Horse Foods. You are what you eat. And I'm gonna be straight up. I kind of stopped pushing it because I got a bad review, but I had like 50 reviews on there and I kind of let that break me a little bit, but at the same time, my business was taking off. And then I rewrote uh, the book to upgrade it, but this person, I can't tell you who it was, he gave a bad review, but out of 56 reviews, and a lot of you guys left reviews, the guy just bombed my book, but at the same time, it kind of left me a certain way, but then I watched this doctor today, and everything that he talked about was everything that I talked about, so I've been on this curve, and whoever that person was, agent, straight agent, tried to rock my frequency, and he, and he did just a little bit, I'm gonna be truthful and say it, you know, that was my first book and my first bad comment crushed me. But guess what? It, it made me. But I'm telling you, man, health is number one. You are what you eat. Trojan Horse Foods on Amazon. Go check it out. 777. Go check it out, man. Get this food together. Get your food together, man. Because you are what you eat. You will act like a chicken. You'll be scared like a chicken. People who eat too much beef move slow like cows. You know what I'm saying? Pigs, oink, oink. Pigs do filthy things. 
You eat a lot of pork, you might find yourself doing a lot of filthy things. Watch what you eat. Watch what you eat. Contains bioengineered food ingredient. Yes, they was fasting because of stuff like this. There's nothing on the sun. Y'all probably think it was, you know, latchets and, uh, if this place been here this long, you think latchets and, 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 and sheep skin and walking around half naked? No, I believe it always been this way. They just want you to think that because they don't hold on to nothing. I looked at a photo from 10 years ago and it looked like it was a hundred years old. But all them photos we thought looked old, maybe they're not as old as they look. They just look old because the picture changes and you know, the, the definition in the world keeps changing. You know, you remember pictures used to look low definition. They just got more technology to bring out more. Those pictures weren't old. It's just that the technology when where it needed to be or they trickled it out. Or maybe I wasn't used to seeing good technology because where I was from, I was low poor. I didn't see the good technology until a certain time in my life. But look guys, there's nothing new under the sun. Please believe, get back fasting, take your body back cleanse these parasites you might even have to do a cleanse 28 30 40 day cleanse that's why a lot of people go on those retreats and go cleanse get this stuff out of their body get these parasites and stuff out of their body this is a real thing i'm gonna I'm a, I'm a, I'm a point it off right here certain parasites will cut off your connection to the cosmos nine ether they'll cut you off and have you kicked over the centronella candle. Had you droned out, man. It's time to take your body back. It's time to take your health back, man. A1 Nutrition for Healing. That's one of my businesses that I have. LLC, A1 Nutrition for Healing, LLC. Trojan Horse Foods. You are what you eat. You, every six months, whatever you put in your body, that's what your skin is. So if your skin look flaky and crackery, and, and weak and brittle is because you're eating all the carbohydrates and your body trying to turn it into skin and it doesn't do it real good. But when you eat what's of the earth, not bioengineered, I'm talking about real stuff of the atmosphere of the four elements, your body, your skin will radiate because it has good regeneration quality. The leaf regenerates, the fruits regenerate, or your cookies don't regenerate, these don't regenerate, they don't. You want regeneration in your body. All this stuff coming out, go check my book out. I've been wrote this stuff and I've been talked about this stuff, man. Yeah, I'm gonna cut it off right there. I've been, I've been on this, I've been on this. I even deleted a whole bunch of my videos thinking I was on the wrong, you know, path. Not wrong path, but trying to force this stuff down the throat. But then I realized, man, the agents kind of stirred me a little bit and that's what they're here to do. But guess what, man, not this time. Y'all take care, man, quantum ascension. Get this stuff out your body because they're trying to cut you off from connecting to the cosmos so you can do what you need to do, which is find out who you are, what you are, so you can handle your business on this earth plane. You take care, man. Love, peace, and ascension, quantum ascension.